Now we're back again with Senators John Kerry and Lindsey Graham for what has been, should I say, a very spirited discussion, <laughs> mostly about Iraq. I want to shift just a little bit. President Bush is uh, in Japan today for the G8 Economic Summit Conference. And at a news conference this morning, he uh, defended his decision to go to the opening ceremonies at the Olympics. Here's what he said. people. Well, <laughs> what he uh, actually said was that it would be an insult to the uh, Chinese people if he did not go to the opening ceremony. Should he be going to that opening ceremony, Senator Kerry? Uh, I think it's, uh, look, that's a very discretionary kind of choice. I think we've been through, you know, politicizing the Olympics. I think if he goes to China and says the important things that need to be said to the Chinese, uh, then it can be turned into something worthwhile. The bottom line is I think that uh, this administration's efforts over the last years with China have been sporadic. Uh, we haven't <coughs> taken advantage of a lot of opportunities. The Chinese want to be serious partners with us in a lot of things, and I think we could be doing a lot better, and I suspect that President Obama will do better. All right, let's see what Senator Graham has to say. I guess the real issue is should you boycott the Olympics and the answer to me has always been no. This is a moment in time for athletes of the world to come together. China is very much a mixed bag. They've helped us with North Korea. Thank God we had the six party talks. Uh, we're making progress in North Korea because China has helped but they're doing some bad things in Tibet. It's a very mixed bag so I'm not going to criticize the president for going to, right. the, to the opening ceremony and, and John's right. He should let them know we have serious differences, but China has definitely helped with North Korea. All right, we're nearly at the end here, but I want to ask both of you about uh, Guantanamo. After the Supreme Court ruling that prisoners there have a right to uh, demand in court that they be shown the evidence as to why they should be held, they're going to have to do something about all those prisoners down there. Everybody agrees about that. Some are going to be brought to trial, apparently. Uh, some are going to be uh, uh, returned to their home countries. But there's probably a hundred or so down there that they really haven't decided what they're going to do with them, and they're dangerous people. What do you think should be done about Guantanamo, and what does Senator McCain think, uh, Senator Graham? Well, I think we need to look at Guantanamo Bay through the law of armed conflict lens, not through the criminal lens. They're not domestic criminals. They're warriors committed to our destruction. They should be treated under the law of armed co conflict. Once you've been properly identified to be an enemy combatant, a military threat to the country, then there's no requirement to release you. If you've committed a war crime, I think the military should do the trial in the military commission setting. Uh, if you can repatriate people, fine, but 30 have been released and gone back to the fight. One became a suicide bomber in Iraq. So I want the military to do the trials, and if you've been properly identified to be an enemy combatant, there's no requirement right. to let you go. Some of these people are going to die in jail because they're too dangerous to let go. All right. Uh, Senator Kerry, and I only have 20 seconds. I'm very sorry. Well, I think Guantanamo should have been shut. It, it, it should be shut now. It never should have existed. I think the administration has uh, really put a blot on American values by not trying these people from the beginning. And I agree with Lindsay in terms of the military component of it. They could have been tried in the field. They could have been tried as combatants. Uh, where they were, but to have gone through these years at Guantanamo without uh, affording any kind of legitimacy for, for rights, it really runs against America's values. We should try people, try them, convict them, and if they deserve to be executed on the basis of uh, that finding, then that's what we should do. But right. it should have been done outside of Guantanamo. It should have been done ages ago, and Guantanamo should be shut, and uh, that's a priority, I think, for an All Obama right. and administration. That's where, that's where we have to leave it.